Well, Allie Bragdon with Oasis of Hope is working so hard with all of our foster care children and parents in a way to kind of give more dignity. Think about exactly. something like you may not have thought about this. So many children when they're leaving a home or going from one home to another. Do you know how they pack their bags if they have anything at all? A lot of the times it's with a trash bag. And think about how that could probably sit and play. So Ali, you're doing some amazing things. Let's talk first about kind of the foster care situation in Greenville in yeah, South what's Carolina. The need? It, sure. it huge. Yes, um, unfortunately we are at crisis level here in South Carolina. Um, we have nearly 4,000 children that are in foster care in South Carolina. Greenville County is the second largest county with a need. Mm -hmm. um, the second largest number of children in foster care. So the need is great for homes right now and so people who are called to foster, we need you desperately. Um, and, and I just love that Oasis is really a place where we want to support foster families um, so that they can give that home and that love and that dignity that you yes. said. That's really, the message that we send these children really shapes their future and they deserve to know that they are worthy children. Because imagine like they've, they're already being, you know, jerked from one home in one situation. So you're already probably feeling a certain way like, well, these people didn't want me. This didn't right. want you. Right. It's always on that sense of like not not belonging, not, belonging, not being wanted. Not, and and so exactly. It's, and that really, we want them to know that they're wanted, they are loved. Um, and so it's very, it's a very important thing for us at Oasis of Hope again to just provide that support to the entire family, mm -hmm. um, those foster parents that are caring for them, and of course that child. Um, who so desperately is wondering, what does my future hold? When will I return home? Will I return home? Yeah. Um, and it's just, it leaves a lot of questions in their minds. So and it's you, an insecurity. If you have the ability, if you have the means, if you have the heart to be able to do this, this is a, a critical need that we need to, to solve here in South Carolina, especially here in Greenville. So It is, and everybody can play a part. Um, just as grateful as we are for y'all inviting us here to be able to share the need, Everybody can play a part. So whether that's your business coming in to financially support, we're we're a nonprofit, mm -hmm. and so the support that our staff provides, and we have the best staff ever. <laughs> um, those needs are really there, and so everybody can play a part. We are all called. This is our community. These are our children, and we need to step up and and really play that part, whatever it is. So what do you need? Someone watching right now is like. Girl, I'm in. How can I help? What can I do? Yes. Well, first of all, we need foster parents, um, obviously. Um, so if you're, again, called to foster, please reach out to us. If you're a business leader or you've been blessed financially, we need financial support to be able to provide the support in these types of events that, mm -hmm. again, just give the opportunity for children in foster care to know that they are worthy of the community support, that we're going to surround them, that we're going to encourage them, and most of all, that God loves them. Yeah. And that's a great opportunity that we have as a community to share. And another way that people can help will be this suitcase giveaway that you're, you're doing. Tell us about that. Yeah, so Focus on the Family gave us 500 um, of these wonderful rolling suitcases because like you said, so many children are moving in trash bags. And so we want to restore their dignity and allow them to move their belongings um, in a wonderful rolling suitcase. They get a great um, soft teddy bear. Um, Jambos has provided um, pajamas. Aww. And we also have um, a Bible for every child. So um, parents of foster children um, and parents who have adopted foster children will be able to just simply drive through next Saturday morning between 10 and noon and pick up um, how many ever suitcases they need. So um, like if that's my family, it's like a whole bucket of suitcases. <laughs> um, so, um, how many ever suitcases you need? And so again, just ab the mm -hmm. ability to restore um, some dignity and, and encourage them. And where is this journey. happening again? This um, we're in Piedmont. Oasis of Hope is at 108 Commons Drive um, in Piedmont, right off exit 40 on I-85. Very convenient. Again, you'll be able to drive in and, and get out very quickly. See, you make yeah. it easy. Drive through, I like it. Let's trade the trash bags for suitcases. It's a small gesture, but really, really means a lot. Yeah, so if you know somebody that has a, is, has a foster parent that has some kids that want to get mm -hmm. some of these suitcases, just drive through and do that. 
Uh, we appreciate you coming on and telling us about it. For Thank everything you that you again. do. Yeah. It's, a, it's a lot. I don't know. It's a lot to sleep with each night, yes. knowing all the need out there. Thank you. We um, appreciate it.